So here's how to save your game in Python. That is, make some code in a Python program that allows you to save a file and also read a saved file, um, maybe from your last go. Uh, so first thing you got to do, um, let's say I've got I've got health of ten in a game and my gold is twenty. Okay, now this doesn't have to be a game. This could be you know taking weather data or something like that or financial data, but we'll do it in the context of a game just because it's easy to understand. All right, so that's what I need to save. All right, um, so first thing you need to do is you need to tell Python to make a file. So all you do is you go f file um, is open, and then what do you want to call it? Um, let's say savey time dot py. Okay, and then what we're going to do is set the mode so that it w for writes. You could put or for reads if you want there, but we're going to write to a save file. Okay, so what that does, it makes or opens a file called savytime.py. Now, if you don't put .py, you know it'll kind of make it a text file. You can you can use a text file, but it's going to be way more complicated because if you want Python to read through a text file, you've got to use a parser or something like that and tell exactly which line. Um, this is it's way easier given that it's Python game and they're Python values to just load in a Python file. Okay, so right, let's continue on. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to write those two values out into the save file. So all you do is you just go f dot write. Now we'll do this kind of one step at a time. So if I just put in health here, so I play it, seems okay, um, and I open it and hey there it is, savey time, and it's super blank. That's because I forgot to <laughs> very meta, but I forgot to save before closing. Actually to be honest, I don't even I just didn't close it. The file is still weirdly open. So I need to go f dot close here and there you go. Alright. Now if I run that, press play and open it, save you time. Hey, it printed the word health. I mean it's not what I wanted, but I'm getting closer. Okay. What I want is for the file to say health is ten, gold is twenty, so it, it takes that data into my game. Um so I'm gonna say health. Well Adding an equals is pretty easy. Um, now, how do I get the actual value 10 in there? If I put in, I mean, I could just go help like that. I'm going to get an error there because it's going to say that this is an integer and you're trying to add, you know, one plus toast here. It, you need to turn this into a string. Okay, so I'm going to put brackets around it and put str in front of it. There we go. Now, if I run that, okay, again, it works pretty well. Let's see um, how we're getting on. Open save time. Excellent. And that that's it, right? Almost. Almost. You're going to find a bit of a bug if you try to do more than one line. I wonder, can you guess what's going to happen? Um, it worked perfect for health. But if I go gold here and I write a line for gold, um, I run it, looks fine, I open it up, and here it is, save time. It's it's going to give it, like, it needs to look like that. I've, it's like someone forgot to hit enter. Um, so, to do that, I just need to tell it to, after you write this line, would you mind hitting the enter key there? So, add on a little command, and it's backslash n. Okay, make sure you got that going the right way. Okay, because um, it's also a forward slash. Um, deadly. And if I was going to do a third one, I could put another, uh, you know, if I was going to do a third value, I could kind of put another one there. You know, but I'm, I'm not. It doesn't do any harm to hit it into that anyway. Cool. So um, now if I run it and open this file, save your time, A, hey, it works perfectly. So that's how to write a save file. So to load your saved data, to pull that into your game, it's real, really easy. You, it's just literally four words at the start of your program, and it loads and everything. Bam.
super easy, way easier than saving to a text file and parsing it. Okay, so here we go. Uh, we just go from whatever the name of your file was, your save file, and just import all. Import all is asterisk. Ta da! You're done. That's that's how it's it's now before the program has even started. It's loading these values. In fact, watch this. I'm going to delete them because it's actually loaded them in from our save file. Um, let's just check if they are there. So at the start of my program now, I'm just going to see if I can print these values. And I shouldn't be able to print these values without a save file because I haven't said that health is 10. I definitely haven't said that gold, I actually don't, really, don't remember what gold is. Uh, maybe it was a 12 or something like that. Um, I don't know. Well, let's see. So we play. And there you go. 10 and 20. So that's how to write to a save file and then at the beginning of your program, load your data again.